Can you uh, focus? Baby, can you focus? Yeah, 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 yeah. It's on me. Hey, y'all, what's poppin'? So today, I decided to do kind of like a vlog thing. I should have done like a get ready with me, but oh well, so whatever. But um, today, I decided to do like a vlog thing and talk about uh, my thoughts and like depression, anxiety, things like that. Um, I'm going out tonight because I'm trying to learn how to be on my own and by myself. Y'all want to see my outfit? Hold on. Excuse my room is kind of messy. But this is my outfit. Is these boots, you know what I'm saying? It's these boots with this top with a little cleavage sewing and then a face beat. This is what I'm going with. Um, it's kind of early, so I'm not really going to head out right now, but I'm going to go get gas in my car because I need to put gas in my car. But y'all want some with me? Okay, let's go. Let me get my stuff, my keys, and uh, we'll get it flipping. This on oh my phone is playing music. I'll be back. I'll meet y'all in the car. Y'all, what is popping? I ain't done this in a minute. Hey guys, I am back again. I ain't done this in a minute. I haven't vlogged in a while. So before I drive, because I'm gonna get gas before I go out. But um, you guys. Even though you don't really see it, and after school and everything, I was talking about it with other people. Sorry, this lighting is bad. But, um, school <laughs> and life uh, was a pain in the ass. I'm not gonna lie, because everything was just so stressful. Um, this semester of school, I go to Cal State LA, this semester of school was probably my most stressful or I would say the hardest because it wasn't just me and this whole year wasn't just me like um, focusing on school and all of that it was the fact that I was also trying to balance my makeup and this is when I started taking makeup artistry seriously and like doing makeup on other people and also trying to upload videos for my YouTube channel on top of that I'm I'm in school and also I'm trying to work and find assignments for my job I'm also a preschool teacher substitute um, assistant so with that it's actually it's kind of hard for me so I've been struggling a lot with myself and learning how to balance everything and I feel like sometimes in life we forget about what it means to I mean I understand when you have to handle what you need to handle and take care of it but we forget about our mental health and and all of that stuff and sometimes we get caught up in too much of the physical health that we forget about our mental health as well but I think for me like it was a lot like i I was just trying to understand myself more and I will still say I'm proud of the woman that I am today I'm still growing there's so much more growth that needs to, to come but um, or that is to come but there is also growth that happened and I am so grateful for that growth within this year even though I cried so much even though I hurt so much even though uh, it was a lot of like back and forth within my head <laughs> and you feel psycho for I don't know if it's only me But I talk to myself whenever I'm going through something and I'll be going back and forth in my head like oh my god Here it is but then this but then this and it's like that's my anxiety that gets the best of me at times And I don't know how to handle it just yet like I, I've never I haven't really fully gotten a good grasp of how to handle my anxiety and even though sometimes it's not obvious um it's really hard for me to but it's more so the fact that I'm always in my head and it makes it hard for me to um, really or fully enjoy a moment or be in the moment sometimes let me start driving now I really hope you guys can hear me but I haven't eaten all day today I'm at a stoplight so I just decided that I would hold this this is a horrible angle. Y'all see my hair growth though? But um, yeah, <laughs> hold on. So I haven't even eaten all day either because I was in my room the entire time. I was just really sad and down. Yeah, y'all, I was just really sad and down about everything, about myself and yeah, I guess you can say deep depression. And the one thing about depression was crazy is that when you're around people, you'll be the happiest person ever. But the moment that you're alone is when like you feel at your lowest. And that's another thing that I'm learning. And I'm starting to go out, go out and do things by myself. Like tonight, I'm going out 
be by myself dressed up looking cute or whatever for myself with myself by myself it's forcing me to focus on me and focus on what I have to do for myself and focus on my path but um, it's just so hard <laughs> sometimes and you just question life and everything oh so I was sitting in my room today and I was like why am I feeling so down like why am I feeling this way and most of the time when I'm feeling down I try to remind myself of the boss ass bitch that I am you know and I try to remind myself of what I have accomplished and what I have done when I was feeling down in my room I was like bruh nah let me watch a video on my YouTube channel and the video that I decided to watch was the one of uh, the body empowerment one when I was showing off my body and I was pointing out my insecurities and I was watching that and I was listening to everything that I was saying damn near in tears no I did cry um, because I was just so proud of the woman that I had became and I was so proud of what I had accomplished and everything that I was able to do and the fact that I was able to put out a message like that to empower people to self-love it's like Chidera this is you this is what you're doing this is what you have the power to do. Why are you doubting any of your capabilities? Why are you doubting the woman that you are? Why are you doubting everything that you have to offer? Why are you doubting that you're not every, like why are you just doubting? Why are you scared? Why are you fearful? You were able to show off your body and point out insecurities and now is when you choose at this moment today is when you choose to be insecure. When you choose to, to, you know, put yourself down in the worst ways possible. Point out every single flaw that you can ever imagine in yourself that I've done. And the fact that I can sit there and do that and I look at that video and I say, Chidera, you are brave. Chidera, you are strong. You are bold. You are you. You are powerful. You give people sometimes a reason to do something you give yourself a reason to continue doing what you're doing and the fact that I watched that video right after that video after I started um, after I was crying and I wiped my tears and everything I sat that sat there and I was like Chidera things you're gonna go through so much in life you're gonna face all these problems you're gonna go through all these bumps and whatever they say the roads the ragged roads you know what I'm trying to say you're going through gonna go through all of this in life but it's up to you whether or not you want to let that get to you. You're going to handle it. You're going to have to figure out how to handle it, how to deal with it. But it's up to you to be a woman, right? And for me to understand my worth as a woman, to know that it's okay. <laughs> You're going to get through it. It's not going to be here forever. You're not going to stay here. I'm not going to get stuck here, you know. I'm at the gas station, by the way. Um, but yeah, the fact that I was able to be my own inspiration just by watching a video... Let's me though that lets me know that my words is not just ones that I speak to other people, but I speak to myself and I use for my own motivation and my own empowerment. So I don't just say these things or speak these things out of randomness or to be random or just to talk because I want to be powerful and encouraging, but I speak this because I go through so many problems with just myself and my own insecurities. And it's not just physical insecurities, like I have insecurities with how I think and how my brain works. Like, the brain is so powerful, it's freaking annoying. Like, it pisses me off. It's so annoying how powerful the brain is. And, um, because of that, how much did I put in my car? 15 or 20? No, or 30. We're gonna find out. We're gonna, we gonna see where my mood is gonna stop. Hold on. Hold on. Ooh. Gas at 339. That's so ugly. Look, there it is. Oh well, I'm gonna have to put it. Let's see where I stop. Oh, oh, you know what? Damn, my ass pushed another button. My ass pushed 89, even though I'm at 87. I'm so mad. I might have to put $20 in my car. I'll plan on doing 15. 
I know you miss me. I'm just kidding. But, um, I think I'm going to have this come to an end. You know what? I'm going to get some food. Because the girl's hungry. You know what I'm saying? Oh, before I get going, I do have my own insecurities with my mind and the way I think. What I hate about my mind is my anxiety. I hate that I think about it so much or I think about situations so much and I'm easy to guilt my tr guilt trip myself about anything. Uh, the, like the smallest things I'll feel bad. I'm always sorry. I'm always apologetic because I'm always questioning what I'm doing, whether it's the right thing or the wrong thing. And most of the time I'll think I'm doing the wrong thing, but I really shouldn't question myself like that. Um, so yeah, I think I'm making that vow to myself starting today, starting now. And I have done it, but I'm making the vow to myself to make more time for me. Make time for me. Make time for what I need to do for myself. Stop questioning everything that you're doing, Shadera. You have the power to do so much more. You know what I'm saying? And... Do I have a booger? I can have boogers. Um... Okay. But yeah, <laughs> make time for myself more and focus on me. Okay, but make focus on me and make time for myself and I'll be okay. Not that I'll be perfectly fine, but it will help me a lot if I just focus on me and learn how to be by myself. I'm going to go get some food. I might get some McDonald's. That's what I'm going to get. Let's go to McDonald's. You guys, I don't know what to get, and I'm here. I'm gonna for sure get a sweet tea. Sweet tea from McDonald's has crack in it or something because I keep drinking that stuff. And it's only a Zola 10 cents. That's the exact price. Yes, I know the exact price because I always buy it. But I'm probably gonna, I'm for sure gonna give me some sweet tea. Hello, welcome to McDonald's. I'm gonna help you tonight. Hi, can I get a medium sweet tea with light ice? Medium sweet tea with a little bit of ice? Okay. And then can I get a McChicken with extra mayo? Okay. And then, can I get a large fry? I'm sorry, you got a large fry fry? Yes. Okay. That's it. Alright, that will be 579 next one, please. Thank you. Y'all, this is going to be fire. <laughs> Y'all, and I hate confrontation. That's another thing I don't like. But I really need to start doing that. Confronting. If it's a no, it's a no. And no more. Don't ask me no more questions. It's a no, it's a no. I hate confrontation. Even though I've done it and I still do it, I hate it. It's the worst feeling ever to confront people about certain shit. Even if they're you're calling them out, I just hate confronting people. It's like it's very ang anxious. It takes a lot of makes me nervous. Fuck out of here! <laughs> I really thought it was crazy. Let me get Arza. Can I do oh, Apple Pay? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, I'm sorry, you saying? Can I do Apple Pay? Of course. Oh, thank God, because I forgot I'm on my <laughs> card. Oh, Jesus, Lord. I got nervous, too, for the first time. Yeah. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. you, too. Yeah, I, didn't, I couldn't find my card. Thank you. You, too. My mother, 16 shots, we But yeah, y'all, I'm good now. I'm doing better, but I just wanted to share how I was feeling. And even though sometimes in my videos, like, I'm always happy and stuff like that, depression is a real thing. Um, you know you're going through real depression where you can cover up very well and always look happy. <laughs> okay. I'm at a stop. But yes, but depression and everything is a real thing. Um, take care of your mental health. Take care of you. You come first. Don't put anyone else before you. Take care of you. It's the most important body that you have at this moment, you know? Um, yeah. It's hard. And I know it's hard to, you know, get out of deep, dark places. But remember who you are. Remember all the things that you've done. If you write in your journal, what helps a lot with me also is writing in your journal. Write your problems down. You will feel so free after. And I'm telling you, you'll feel like a weight is lifted off of your shoulders. Write in your journal. 
um, express what you feel. Do whatever you can to just let out your feelings. Even if you feel have feel like you have no one to talk to, write in your journal. That will help you. Or just remind yourself of who you are. If you have a journal, if you've written in a journal, read those things that you were going through. Read compared to who you are now. Know that you are more than just what your past was. You are more than what you went through. You are who you are now because of that. You've gotten stronger. You've learned how to love you. You've learned how to accept you. Remind yourself of who you are. You are boss ass at whatever you do. You can accomplish whatever you want to accomplish. You are beautiful. You are powerful. You are everything and beyond. Know that and believe that. And I don't want to just say this because, you know, I'm trying to motivate you, but also believe it. It's so hard to believe things. I want to remind you that you are something. Please don't forget that. Um... I forget it myself, but I don't want you to forget that. Please hold on to that. Know that you're more than just your problems. Um, I just want to let you know that I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe um, down below. Any suggestions for another video? If you need a vent, you know where to find me. My Instagram is at Chidera Bosa. Snapchat at Chidera underscore Bosa. Uh, Twitter is Thick Thighs Thrive or at Chidera Bosa. <laughs> um, and yeah. Thank you guys for watching. I love you guys. Stay dangerous. Love you. Do you. And always best possible. And I think that's all I have for you guys. Bye. Love you. Mwah. Deuces.